Yo, what's poppin' people? Welcome back to another episode of Kicking Their Bass TV. Everybody's been asking Noah, when are you getting out on the boat? Today is the day. We're out here on Lake Mare. You guys know this is one of the most pressured lakes around us. And we're gonna try to get on some really big fish today. I got a special guest with me today you guys have not seen in a while and we're just excited to do some fishing. We're gonna hop on it, try to catch some big ones today. I hope you guys enjoy it. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Hit the like button if you guys have been enjoying the content. And more importantly, drop some comments down below on the videos you wanna see. We got some more boat content coming up very soon. You know, I've been traveling a ton and I've just been bank fishing a lot. So I'm like, I'm ready to get back on the boat. Springtime's coming around, the fish are pushing up. And it's time for us to catch some big ones. Let's go ahead and hop right into it. Look who we got. Yo, Brad. What's up? <laughs> What's up, dude? It's been, it's been way too long. Way too long. You have not been doing too much fishing, have you? Nah. Not bass fishing. Not bass fishing. You've been saltwater fishing? Yeah. You wanna see my boat? Yeah, so it's been a while since we had an intern Brown on the channel. This man's been working a lot and he hasn't really been fishing much, but he did get a new boat and uh, let's see if we can see it. I got a sheer water. It's so blurry, I'm trying my best, let's see. Oh yeah, that's a beaut. Yeah. So you've been having fun on that? Trying to. We're gonna have to go out there and catch some redfish very, very soon. But yeah, we got intern Brad back on the channel. It's been a while. So we're just gonna have some fun today, go around Lake Mayer, see if we can find some fish pushed up shallow and uh, see if we can put a game plan together today. I actually talked to two supporters of the channel since we've been here. One of the kind gentlemen, he, he actually walked that way around the pond. He said that he hasn't had any luck today. That's been a little tough, but a couple days ago, he caught some really good fish. So I think we're gonna get on them. We're just gonna put our heads down, try to catch some big fish. There's actually another supporter of the channel in the background over here. And he said that there's like a four pounder on bed and he's like, I can't catch it. He's like, you guys could come over here and try to catch it. So. I think we're gonna go over there, introduce him to you guys, and see if we can catch this fish. Let's get after it. All right, y'all, we're gonna get this started. I got a spinning combo right here. Um, I actually got to tie me a new leader. Look at that knot right there, oh, that little fray. Is that a fray? It'll be all right. <laughs> hooks, hooks into an eight pounder, just breaks off. Yeah, that's a knot right there. So we're gonna go ahead and tie a leader on the spinning combo. If you guys wanna check out any of the Kicking Their Bass x -Lose combos, only available on my website, kickingtheirbass.com. I have the link in the description box down below. We got the spinning combos and also right hand and left hand bait casters. So yeah, you can check them out on my website. I appreciate everybody. And uh, it's crazy because he, no, he does have one. Look at that, Bradley. Yeah, he He's got a rod. And then the other guy that came up to us earlier, he said he got one this morning. Yeah, he said he bought one this morning. So that's, that's sweet. A 10 pounder today, no. Are we gonna give away one of those rods? I will 100%. Will we do it? Yeah, 100%. Can you do it for the fans? Yes. You know one, they want the rods. 100%. All right. If we, that's not even a question. Oh, I just made it a, I made that's, it, I made it a real deal. Yeah, we're, we're gonna do it. <laughs> I wasn't recording. <laughs> I don't know what that was, but I was like, oh God. What's that? Oh, oh no, was, <laughs> was that your bait? <laughs> Like, that was funny. He was like, what was that? All right, y'all. We're going to be using one of these Ned Ochos by Striking. If you guys want to check out any of Striking baits, use my discount code. Link in the description box down below. Link in code. But yeah, I'm going to try this out on my spinning combo. I haven't thrown like a little Ned in a minute. And I was like, you know what? We'll try it. Or it's an experiment today. So I got that. And I got this Texas rig. I'm going to check my line. This is 20 pound for you. You want us to try to catch it? Yeah. You want to meet us down there? We can try. All right, guys. Well, he said he's going to show us a little fish down here that he couldn't catch earlier. We're going to see if we can play with him for a second to start off the video. Five Wouldn't that be cool? How are you? Yeah. No, that's awesome. I saw his rod, too. Thank you, guys. I appreciate that. I just want to know if it's better to blind flip or... I just feel like these spots are going to be like spots that people are going to easily hit, you know what I mean? That three pounder I just saw is pretty nice. It's just hard to see you with really the, need, like, something to stand. the clouds. Yeah, you do. There's usually some that bed in this corner real good. You got hit? You got one? No. -uh. Look at that. He ain't big. Put me on the channel, poop. <laughs> yeah. A little tiny one. Yeah, I'm sure there's some bigger ones. 
I don't like that little bait. Well, you got hey, you got to start somewhere, right? Yeah. That's pretty quick. Yeah, I'm I'm satisfied with that. He ain't big, you but you get skunked. Yeah, we we didn't get. <laughs> Lake Mary is notorious for skunking people, so I, I we can't complain with that. Yeah. I mean, he ain't big, but that's a start. I just want to see. It's hard to see, dude. Like it's so hard to. No, like I'm just blind flipping. This is like. Whoop, whoop. I got one. Dude, are you kidding me, Bradley? I stopped the GoPro and that fish was just running with it, dude. He ran all the way under the boat. That's so aggravating, guys. I just messed up big time. That fish slammed me up there. It was when I turned off the GoPro. And then he ran all the way up here and then I, I ended up missing him. Well, good luck to you. I appreciate you supporting the channel. Thank you. Flip it and pitch it. Pitch it and flip it. You know how long it's been since I've done this? Flip. <laughs> yeah, probably with you. Yeah. Dude, that one is not easy actually. See, my problem is with this hyacinth. One, where the heck did this hyacinth come from? When you get in that hyacinth, does it have all that slop? And will the fish see your bait? You know what I mean? That's how we used to catch a lot of bed fish. You, dude, there's a big one on bed. You see that? He just, like, looked at he just rolled. I didn't know it. I skipped up there on him. Did you see him move though? Yeah, I don't know where he went. He was up there though. I, I, oh yeah, you see him? Look how big he is, Bradley. Yeah. Oh my goodness, that's like a four pounder. Oh, There's two. That's a good spot. I can't hurt. I can't either. That's I don't know where he went. He pulled off. My bait sit. Oh no, he's pulling up on my bait. You see him sitting off on the left hand side of that tree. I'm hung. On what? I don't know. I skipped it up on that tree. You see it? Okay. <laughs> okay. This is how. The Nedrick sounded like a good idea until you're skipping under a tree to get on a bed. And you're not up your brain. This thing is really like Fantastic. Like whole thing. We just remember to come back here on the way out, you know what I mean? And we, and we prepare. Mentally prepare ourselves. Not even that, just... Got him. I'm big. That, we got the ball rolling. Okay. We both got the monkey off our back with some of the smallest little squeaks. Look at him peeing, dude. Little male, dude, he is going crazy. Calm down, buddy. It's the smallest little bass. Did he hit it hard? Yeah, no, he, he, he hit it pretty hard. So yeah, we both got a fish now, guys. We've been, we haven't been fishing too long, but we've been just covering water, trying to find these I fish. See I see a fish right there, Bradley. He's, he's right there. He's actually coming over towards you. The problem with this place, guys, is one. There's so many people fishing right now, like on the bank. So they've just. These fish have taken a beating these last few weeks, and you know, I, I actually kind of feel bad for the fish. But it makes it that much harder because you know a lot of these fish have been caught before. Oh, we didn't see if that one's been stuck. We've seen some big ones today too. We've seen a couple really big ones that we're gonna go back to. Um, but it is kind of hard to see with it just being cloudy. Sun's not really out. It's not the easiest time to fish this place if it was like bluebird skies no wind that would be the best time to be hitting this stuff but we're just gonna keep on covering some water we're gonna get into some big ones today i'm just glad we kind of got got the ball rolling look at that fry right there you see that it's insane Dude, man, you guys want that? Oh. oh dude that's a good one Oh my gosh, that was so cool. Oh, well, I think we got got the ball rolling, boys. A little group fry, about a three pounder. Eggs. Let's get it, dude. That's a freaking fatty, bro. Wow, beautiful fish. All right, Bradley, this is a great little sign here. I want you to look at something. No, no hook marks. No hook marks. 
So this fish hasn't been getting beat up, which makes me feel good. <laughs> Yeah, you can't get this fish. Not only that, but you see, this is the second bass I've seen in the group of fry. And that's that's almost a three, you think that's about a three pound oh, fish. Dude. Yeah. Bring wow. out the scale so you can get your big well, Guys, that's a nice bass right there. I was glad to, to get it started. I had him good. He went, come on. Pretty little fish. What is this? Oh, I'm fishing though. Pretty oh, bass. Fish. I just caught my first one, and then all of a sudden I flipped in that group of fry, and this guy, I saw him eat it. That's awesome. Nice little three pounder yonder that's the start we want some bigger ones than that and i think we're gonna get it but we got us one good one so far me and bradley both caught a fish before that it just wasn't big Let's see what else we can do what how big oh it gets the fry oh he's gonna eat you he's gonna eat you that's a good one ain't it he ate you he ate you <laughs> yes <laughs> Oh, that was cool, Bradley. Dude, the fry. Maybe we just figure something out right here, dude. Three groups of fry, three fish right below the fry, and they eat it instantly. You got them, buddy? A little pound and a half or two pounder? Chomp. Nice. I nice think we figured it out. It's pretty fish. The fries. It's there. <laughs> That's cool. Two groups of fry, just like that. I was about to say, I thought he opened his mouth and ate you. I, you probably didn't feel it, did you? I I felt it when you started running. Yeah. Bro, <laughs> What's up, man? How you doing? Right. Yeah, I'm doing good. How about you? Yeah. Like, that's awesome, man. I appreciate you. Nice Thank you, man. You have a good one. I like this bed coming up. You got one? Oh no. Got one? Oh yeah, I do. Get him! Ooh. Dude, did you see that? I never saw him eat it. I saw and every time he eat it, I just saw him just oh, up. Yeah. Did you see how quick that thing freaking took off? My rod whistled. <laughs> Dude, I never saw him never saw the fish, never saw him eat him. I just wanted to throw up there. That's how we're gonna have to do it if we I'll see one good. like that. He pull up again? Yeah, he did. Oh, he just ate you. He just ate you. Oh, he spit it out, didn't he? Oh, nice. Look at Brad. Oh, dude, that was awesome. You said you just want to be caught. <laughs> That's hilarious. Not a bad one. Not a big one, but not a bad one. Bradley, that fish pulled back up. Let's oh. see if I can double up. You see him up there? I don't know if that's the thing. fat. This is just fat. Let me see what you got. Chunk. It's pretty fish. Good job, man. All right, we're doing something now. We, we're getting somewhere. Not the big ones. There's a huge one looking at us. You see him? Look, look you swam them all. That might be a five. Oh, that's awesome. It was nice to meet you guys. Thank you for watching the videos. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> That's awesome. Thank you. Guys, we have met so many supporters of the channel today. And I would just like to say thank you guys for the support. If you guys ever see me in public, please come up and say hey. We have met Bradley, how many people? I feel like almost every person on the dang bank. It's yeah, kind of crazy. Like people playing basketball, I don't even know what they're doing. Doing track stuff. Yeah, we've, just we've met. People out here just Enjoying the beautiful day. Yeah, it is a nice day. And we met some people fishing, which was cool. But yeah, only thing that can make it better is if we catch nine, some, nine. some a 10 pounders nine, so we can get eight, the rod nine, away. Ten. We're gonna go try to find him. We're gonna go try. Oh yeah, he's up there too, Bradley. I'm gonna throw it up on the grass and work it off. Yeah, he's still sitting there. He's on the left though. Guys, we got a pretty good one. This is definitely, I think, it'd be the biggest fish of the day. I think he's over four. I'm gonna just keep it there. Oh, he's looking at me. I think that's the smaller one. He's about to eat it. He's about to eat it. Here we go. Dude, he is on me. Please eat it. He ate it. Got it, dude. 
God, dude, this fish is strong. That's not even the big one. That's a male. Fry is a little tiny. Yeah. Yeah, I know you haven't fished your long. <laughs> it's all good. Bro, that fish is fighting hard though. Oh, that's a pretty good one. That's a pretty good fish. It took me a second to catch her. I mean, it's a three pounder. Let's go. Okay. Where's the big one? Pretty one. Is that the big one? No, that's not the big one, dude. The big one tried to eat me a second ago. Look at that. <laughs> that's a pretty fish. What you think, Bradley? That's a nice one. Quality, I think that's... I don't know, I think the one earlier was the bigger. Yeah, the other one is bigger earlier, but gotta love it, guys. Second, pretty good bass today. Get her back in the water. Thank you, baby. Let her swim back on her bed. Or his bed. And that's not even a female. Did she had it for a second, bro. I, I literally thought in my head, I was like, does she have it? And then all of a sudden, it, I felt her ticket, but I think it was her just eating it further. We got a lot of beds, it looks like, coming up. What the f***? Bro, how did that even get on me, bro? That's not poisonous. No, it's not. These are not poisonous. Caterpillars are poisonous. Not this one. How do you know? Because I love caterpillars, dude. Those aren't poisonous. How do you know? No, I used to hold those all the time when I was younger. You want to touch them? No, I'm good. Bro, how did that even get on me? Hook it on, hook it on a hook. <laughs> Honestly, he would get destroyed. What do I do with him, bro? I'm gonna just let him chill on the boat. All right, buddy. Look at that. Look at that, dude. Yo. What a thug. Yeah. Bro, that freaked me out, dude. I was like, there's something getting in my leg. And I like kept hitting it like it was a gnat. And I looked down, it kind of freaked me out, dude. <laughs> I didn't know what that thing was. I think the male is just sitting there. He's going up to me right now. Dude, he's on me. I think he just ate it. Oh, he did. I didn't, uh, I didn't stick him though. He grabbed it by the tail and pulled it off the bed. Watch, all right. Watch my worm, he's gonna roll up on it. Yeah, see him rolling up on it? That's not the big one. It's a good, it's a nice one though. It's a pretty fish. That's pretty cool. Yeah, they're getting a little aggravated right there. Well, guys, we're getting on them today. We're finally figuring some stuff out. We still have so much water that we really wanted to hit that we just haven't. So we got plenty of room. That's a pretty two pound fish right there. Let her go. Hey, Give her a little pet. Pretty fish.